given 4 square root of x is equal to square root of 4x. So we have to find out the value of x here. How we can find out the value of x? Let's see solution. Four square root of x is equal to square root of four x. Right, this is question. So we have to first cancel this square. So square root. So we can take square uh, square on both sides. So taking square on both sides because we have to cancel this square root. So four square root of x whole square is equal to square root of four x square right we are taking square both sides now 4 square 4 square is 16 and square root of x whole square so square is cancelled from square root is equal to now here it will become square is cancelled from square root right so we can write this one 4 x because when we are taking square, so it will become 4 square, that is 16, and here x square. So square root of 16 is 4, and square root is cancelled from a square, uh, square is cancelled from a square root, so here it will become x. So 4x. So we can say this one, 16x is equal to 4x. 16x is equal to 4x. Now, uh, here 4, so we can divide this number by uh, 4. So divide by 4 on both sides. So 16x divided by 4 is equal to 4x divided by 4. Now this 4 is cancelled from this 4 and 4 4 is a 16. So 4x is equal to x. Right, we got this equation. So we can write this 4x minus x is equal to 0. In equation form 4x minus x is equal to 0. Now 4x minus x. So 4x minus x is 3x. So, 3x is equal to 0. Now, we have to find out the value of x. So, we can divide, to cancel this 3, we can divide by 3 both sides. So, divide by 3 on both sides. We will get 3x power 3 is equal to 0 by 3. So, 3 is cancelled from 3. So, x is equal to 0 by 3 is 0. So, x is equal to 0. We got the value of x here that is 0. Now this is the first method. Now we are using, we are solving this equation using second method. So let's see second method. Now in second method 4 square root of x is equal to square root of 4x. So we can divide here by square root of x. So divide both sides by square root of x. Then we will get 4 square root of x divided by square root of x is equal to square root of 4x divided by square root of x right now we got this value so we can do here one thing 4 square root of x square uh, root of x square root of x it will become cancelled so 4 is equal to square root of 4x divided by square root of x right now if we are taking square both sides uh, so we can cancel this square roots so taking square on both sides we will get 4 square is equal to square root of 4x whole square divided by square root of x whole square right now 4 square 4 square is 16 and here a square is cancelled from square root so it will become 4x divided by square is cancelled from square root 4x by x right so we got here one equation that is 16 is equal to 4x upon x so we can write if you are uh, doing cross multiplication so 16 times x that is 16x is equal to 4x now we have to cancel this 4 so we can divide by 4 on both sides so divide by 4 on both sides then we will get here 16x divided by 4 is equal to 4x divided by 4 4 for just 16 now we got here 4x is equal to x so 4x uh, 4x is equal to x so 4x minus x equal to 0 we can write this one now here x is common we are taking x common so 4 minus 1 is equal to 0 right 
now x 4 minus 1 is 3 equal to 0 so 3x is equal to 0 again we have to cancel this 3 because we have to find out the value of x so we can do now here 3x is equal to 0 right so we have to cancel this 3 so divide by 3 on both sides 3x divided by 3 is equal to 0 divided by 3 3 is cancelled from this 3 so x is equal to 0 again we got here this value x is equal to 0 right and same value uh, same value of x we got in first method so value of x equal to 0 this is correct solution now let's verify this correct or not so let's verify this value for x is equal to 0 so 4 square root of x is equal to square root of 4 x this is question and if x is equal to 0 we have to substitute, uh, substitute this value of x uh, this value of x here so 4 times square root of x that is 0 is equal to 4 times x that is 0 right or you can do this one so 4 square root of 0 when we are multiplying with any number uh, 0 with any number we will get here 0 and here same value square root of 4 times 0 4 times 0 is 0 and square root is 0 so we can say 0 is equal to 0 so here LHS is equal to RHS so value of x equal to 0 this is correct solution for this equation thank you